everyone. Um, I just wanted to share an experience that I had, like, between last night and this morning that, you know, I was working on my, my right processor for my cochlear implant kept on dropping, and I, it just wouldn't connect to my phone. So I thought, okay, maybe my app is old and I need to reinstall it. So I did that. I deleted it and I reloaded my processors and nothing. My, my right processor just got dropped again. So I thought, well, never mind. <laughs> so I just left it the way it was. And so this morning I thought, darn it, you know, I'm going to get this fixed. So um, I got an email from Cochlear and so I was going through the email to see what was interesting. And there was a section in there that said resources. I thought, great. So I clicked on that, and that took me to a page of a variety of things, but also, you know, questions and answers. And so I went to the chat section, and um, I engaged with, with uh, the workers from Cochlea saying, you know, I, this is driving me crazy. I have, you know, my right Cochlear, which is an N8, keeps on getting dropped from my phone. And so it's not connecting at all with phone calls or anything else. So they said, well, you know, you might have, and then <laughs> the worker said, oh, <laughs> another worker's gonna come on. <laughs> and he left and another person came on. So Myra says to me, well, you know, we haven't gotten that far in terms of, you know, getting that connected to, um, you know, the, the Samsung's Galaxy phones. So I was like, oh. But she said, we want to encourage you to delete the app. <laughs> so I did that last night. And I said, well, we encourage you to do it again <laughs> and um, reinstall your processors and, and see how it goes. So I went on and looked for the, I deleted the app from my phone I went online to look for, you know, the the apps. And so I was very, very careful in, in picking the right one because there's one generic and there's another one that's for Android. So I picked that one and loaded it and then reinstalled my processors onto, you know, the, the app itself. And voila. <laughs> so finally. But Hopefully it'll stick this time. <laughs> it's very frustrating because my right processor just flunk, and I don't know why. But you know this this is a lesson in which, you know, we got to keep on trying and not to give up. <laughs> so I was like, oh. <laughs> you know, it uh, the N8. It's true that it is new and has not been installed in, in all the different phones and all the different technologies. Uh, so you might run into some issues because that takes a long time and a lot of text to do that, to reinstall it or install it, you know, for a phone to accept that particular um, technology. So it's just really important to be patient and um, contact the company. You know, if you have Resound or you have Otacon or if you have, you know, any other hearing aids, don't give up. You know, just contact the company and, and get things turned around. It takes patience sometimes with technology. It really does. So because I didn't give up, now my processor, my right processor, has been reinstalled to my phone, and hopefully it'll continue to work. <laughs> if it doesn't, I'll let you know, but so far it's good. So um, I would say in, 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 in technology in general, it's really important to, to be patient, to say, this is driving me crazy. I'll try it tomorrow. And that's what I did, you know, because I reinstalled the app and it still didn't work. So, um, so, you know, Today was a fresh day, it was a new day, so I tried it again, and it worked. So sometimes it takes another day, sometimes. So the message here is 
patient. You know, if you get frustrated, do it another day. Just turn around, do something different, and pick it up tomorrow. <laughs> but don't give up. So patience and don't give up with technology. <laughs> so and go directly to the company to ask, you know, or if you're seeing your ideologist soon, which I was not. I don't see my ideologist until August. <laughs> then, then, you know, I just have to breathe and do it the following day. So that is my message for today, uh, for uh, Tech Tuesday. And I hope all of you are doing well. And thanks so much for coming by. I am very grateful for each one of you for coming, for visiting, for listening, and watch another video. And I'll see you in a very soon. <laughs>